name is Becky. Uh, I am part of the events team here at Special Effects. We are the gamers charity. So tell us a little bit more about what you do. Cool. So Special Effect uh, make and modify video game controllers for people with uh, physical disabilities so that they're still able to play video games. And how, how long have you been doing this for? How did the charity come about? Cool. So uh, we're actually 10 years old this year. Uh, this September is our 10th anniversary. Uh, the charity started by our CEO and founder, Dr. Mick. Um, he started as literally one man and his dog in the back garden, um, thinking I can change something, uh, and and he did. Uh, so we're now a team of uh, about 20 people working out of an office in Charlbury, and we work all over the country uh, with people with disabilities so that they're still able to play. And what are some of the kind of modifications that you make to help people play games? So we have a team of occupational therapists that work at the charity and we'll go out and actually visit people in their homes and fully assess their needs, their movement and what games they want to play. So we don't just work with a set number of games like you can only play this or you can only <laughs> play that. It's what do you want to play, what do you want to play it on, what's your favourite console and we will try and make that happen for people. So the demos that we've got on stand today are an eye control demo and a chin control demo. So the eye control is really good for people who have very, very limited movement, have maybe been in a, an accident um, and, and been paralysed. Um, and the chin control demo is good for people with a little bit of movement. We've got some big, uh, really, really tough buttons that take a lot of damage as well. So if people have less control over their movement, they're still able to play and not have to worry about maybe breaking a bit of equipment. Um, and how can people get involved? How can people help you guys out? Uh, we have an amazing team of volunteers, so we're always looking for volunteers. Uh, you can head to the website and uh, there's literally a how can I get involved button. Just click that for some more information. Uh, we have a lot of people uh, take part in our yearly fundraiser called Game Blast. Again, more information on the website. Um, that is kind of a, uh, people do like 24 hour live streams for us across the country, get together with their communities and have bake sales, that kind of thing. We're all funded through things like that. So we don't receive any government funding. It's all through communities and gamers like yourselves and your viewers. Fantastic. And finally, how have you found it being at EGX? Oh, amazing. EGX <laughs> is so fantastic. Like it's, I love the rest section. So I'm, if, if I'm away from the sand, <laughs> I'm playing some indie game somewhere. There's some amazing stuff on. And EGX uh, really look after us. They actually donate this space to us. So we're so lucky. We're in an amazing location and we've been able to speak to loads of people today. So thank you so much, EGX. It's amazing. Oh, fantastic. Well, thanks so much for speaking to us. No worries. Thank you.